Hey, hello, hi, welcome everybody back to a new video and today I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get rid of parental controls off of your 30s. So doing this is extremely easy. It's just a few simple steps in a website. You don't need custom firmware for this at all. And it's really good for like when you guys buy a used Wii DS or 30S or something and it comes with a parental lock like the one you see right here. If we go ahead and press OK, it'll come with like some code. We don't know the code. So what we're going to be doing is getting rid of that. So yeah, let's just get right into it. Alrighty, so first things first, you want to go over to your settings and then you want to go to wherever you have the parental controls. Okay, so once you're on your parental controls, you can go over and press change and you can go ahead and press I forgot and then if you don't know the secret question you can go ahead and press I forgot again you go ahead and press back and then there we go you can see we have an inquiry number and basically what we're gonna do next is go over to a website and we're gonna go and put this inquiry number and I'll show you guys what to do from there alrighty so now that we're on our computer I'm gonna be leaving a link in the description and it should take you to this site over here which is pretty bare bones you would you could just go ahead and go and put in all your stuff you can go ahead and put the 3ds or whatever thing you're on you can go ahead and put the date February 22nd and just like that and then what you want to do next is you want to go and put in that inquiry number you saw earlier and just like that you want to leave the space in and then you want to go ahead and just press go and there we go you can see your master key is this right here so what we can do next is we can go ahead and go back to our 3ds and i'll show you guys what to do from there Alrighty, so now that we're back on our 3ds we can go ahead and just press ok and then we can go and put in that key we saw earlier and then we can go ahead and just press ok and then there we go you can see it says master key confirmed we can just go ahead and press ok from there and then we can go ahead and choose a new pin we can just go ahead and press next okay and then we could just put any kind of code we want so we could, there we go i'm gonna do two four five two and there we go we can go ahead and just choose a secret question i'm gonna just do this right now real quick okay so now that we created our secret question we can go ahead and just press ok and then what we can do next is just go ahead and press clear settings and just delete it and then from there on we don't have the parental lock anymore so we can just go ahead and go back and then if we go ahead and try to go on a game you could see that our parental lock is going to be off so we can just go ahead and go back to mario land and press ok and as you can see the game launches up so yeah it's just a quick little easy fix that you don't even need custom firmware or a computer for pretty good for if you guys uh, bought a used console and there's a parental lock on it you could go ahead and try this with the switch and the 3ds and whatnot and it'll still work basically just very similar steps and yeah so make sure to leave a like for more 3ds videos subscribe join our discord server and i'll see you guys in the next video